मिस्टर हेलाल अबू शेख गुड इवनिंग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन एंड डिस्टिंग्विश गेस्ट आई वांट टू थैंक फॉर टेकिंग टाइम आउट ऑफ योर बिजी स्केड्यूल टू बी हियर टू नाइट I know you could have chosen to be elsewhere and that the fact you are here speaks volumes about your dedication to the community. You trust me and you support of this campaign. You have given me advice, moral support and financial support at a critical time in this process. and for this i am humbly grateful i owe special gratitude to a group of honored guests who are with us tonight i have a deep respect for all of you you are a great leader in our community and role model for me personally you give me hope that i can be successful in my bid to city councilman for district 32 in queens i can be someone who make a difference people have asked me why i am running for city council first and foremost i love queens my wife and i have made the surrounding area our home for two decades Our two daughters go to school here in Queens and I attend New York City College of Technology where I earn my bachelor degree in computer information and I earn my master's degree in adolescent mathematics education from Brooklyn College. I began my career as a teacher and it has been a very good to me. and now it's time for me to give back i care about district 32 for those of you who don't know district 32 cover bill harbor breezy point broad channel hamilton beach howard beach lindenwood nepose ozone park rockway beach rockway park south ozone park South Richmond Hill and Old Haven. I I look around. I see things that could be better. We are a diverse community, but we all want the same things. We want to dis We want to preserve affordable housing for our residents. We want to increase funding for our senior program center and take a better care for our elders. We want clean, safe park. We want to see air pollution reduce, and we want more efficient recycling program. We want small business that help our community thrive. Most importantly. We want valuable resources in our public school and safe neighborhood. <laughs> Education is an issue that is near and dear to me. As a public school teacher, I know firsthand that we are not doing enough. I see public school closing at the time when we should give our children more. they deserve great teacher they deserve after school educational program for tutoring and help with homework they deserve music art and athletics students with religious background deserve kosher and halal food and they deserve to have their holiday recognized our children are the future and we must give them the best chance to succeed 
The vision that we all have for the community needs someone with the desire and the skill to help. After a lot of deliberation, I am embarking on this journey and want you stand with me and when you do, no one will say that you are on a team that is going to lose. Our campaign is going to be smart. Be in touch with the needs of the community and most of all we are going to work hard. I acquired those characteristics in a college where I was the first person of South Asian descent to be elected president to the Student Government Association. <laughs> During my time as a president, I had one of the most diverse panels in the college history. All students were represented on my panel, African American, Jewish, Hispanic, Asian American, and Latino. Through that experience and my years as a teacher, I have learned and I importance of serving everyone in the community. And now I am fully prepared to serve the large community of District 32. As an element of my campaign that I embrace is that possibility that I will be the first South Asian American in the city council. If, it, if I can't do it, city tag. Why not city council? Our community is underrepresented in the New York City government. Our voice deserve to be heard. As a city councilman, I will proudly represent South Asia and all the rest of our diverse community. I will not overlook the needs of any resident. I will reach out everyone in our community so they know that my voice represents the entire district. One, a community where each and every person is valued and involved in the decisions that affect our lives as important first step in making that this is a really, it is ensuring everyone in District 32 is registered to vote. Too many people aren't and they, there is no excuse not to register. As American, we have the right and the responsibility to take part in every election. If you know you, anyone who is a registered voter, please encourage him or her. Get this done as soon as possible. I want those voices to be heard. And I want to fight for a better quality of life their behalf. If you are already registered, there are other ways you support my bid for city council. Follow my campaign on Facebook and Twitter and encourage those in our community to do the same. Volunteer to knock on the door or make phone call. Offer to collect signature or assist with mailing sponsor a house party. Donate what you can. Visit my website, halalshek.com, and get involved. Every little bit helps, and no contribution is too small. I want to tell you a little secret about city council race. The winner of the Democratic primary needs no more than 7,500 voters. Think about that number and how many people are in the room. If each of you dedicated yourself to getting the commitment of just 20 people to vote for me, and you ask each of those people to take 20 more, we will win this race. We can and we will win. This race 
but we can only do it together. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your trust and me con confidence in me. And most importantly, thank you for your friendship. Before I let you go to connect with your neighbor and enjoying this evening, I want to thank I want to thank one final person, my wife. <laughs> the decision to run did not come easy to me. I needed to know you that I would get at least two votes, my own and my wife's vote. I am glad to say that she has been behind me and we share vision together. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you, Akhar Shabai Akhar আপনারা আমার জন্য আমাদের জন্য এটা আসলে আমার জন্য বললে ভুল হবে এটা আমাদের জন্য আমরা সবাই বলে যদি চেষ্টা করি আমি স্টিল বিলিভ করি উই কেন ডু ইট ইফ ওবামা ক্যান ডু ইট ইফ ট্রাম্প ক্যান ডু ইট উই ক্যান ডু ইট দিস ইজ আমেরিকান ড্রিম আমেরিকান ড্রিমটা এটাই আমেরিকান ড্রিম আমেরিকানে এই এই আমরা এটাই যদি বিলিভ করি আমরা যদি আমেরিকার সবকিছু বিলিভ করি আজকে আমি আপনি কোথায় ছিলাম কোথা থেকে আপনি আজকে হেলাল শেখ কইলা আই ওয়াজ ইন এক্স ড্রিমিং ফর দ্যাট So I could do it. Believe me, I could do it. After that, we shall buy a machine. We will make it happen. After that, we have a shout them. We have a decision. We will make it. It's an act somewhere till now. We have to keep trying. But after that, shall buy me. Hard to get this to go to be. Amra shall buy me. It's our job now. Our bachelor, our brother, our boss. I'm I'm sorry. 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 আমাদের সব মানুষের আছে আমাদেরও দরকার এখানে যে আমাদের পিছু পাও হওয়ার কিছু নাই ইফ যদি ট্রাম্প যদি হইতে পারে এক্স ওয়াই জি যদি প্রেসিডেন্ট ইলেকশনে যদি বলে যে আমার বাবা পঞ্চাশ ডলার আন্ডারওয়্যার নিয়ে ডিশ ওয়াশ করে আজকে আই এম রানিং ফর প্রেসিডেন্ট ওয়াই নট মি আই হ্যাভ এ ম্যাস্টার্স ডিগ্রি ওয়াই নট মি সো ফর দি কিড যাতে আমি জানি আমাদের একজন বাঙালি ভাই কাউন্সিল ম্যানে উনি দাঁড়াচ্ছেন এবং আমাদের বাঙালি কমিউনিটিকে নেতৃত্ব দিবেন ফিউচারে সেই জন্য আমার নিজের থেকেই এখানে চলে আসছি আমার আমি আসলে ফ্লাশিংয়ে থাকি এটা আমার ডিস্ট্রিক্ট না তারপরে আমার নিজের ব্যক্তিগত এক্সপিরিয়েন্স থেকে আমি এটা বলতে পারি যে লাস্ট গ্রেস মিঙ্গার ইলেকশনে যখন উনি প্রথম ইলেকশনে গ্রেস মিং নিয়ে হয়েছে ক্যান্ডিডেট হয়েছিলেন ওনার বাবা আমাকে ডেকেছিলেন কারণ যেহেতু আমি চাইনিজ বলতে পারি তো বলছিলেন যে আপনার বাঙালি এবং ইন্ডিয়ান কমিউনিটিকে ইনভাইট করেন এবং দাওয়াত দেন তখন আমার লোকজনকে দিয়ে আমি অলমোস্ট মোর দেন নাইন হান্ড্রেড বোট আমি ওনাকে রিও করার চেষ্টা করেছিলাম এবং মোর দেন নাইন হান্ড্রেড ফ্যামিলিকে আমি কল দিয়েছিলাম সেইভাবে আস্তে আস্তে আমি মনে করি যে আমাদের বাঙালি কমিউনিটি যদি সকল একত্রে হয়ে এই ভাইকে আপনারা সহযোগিতা করেন ইনশাল্লাহ উনি বুটে ইলেকটিক ইলেকটেড হবেন এবং আমি উনাকে অগ্রিম শুভেচ্ছা এবং কংগ্রেচুলেশন জানাচ্ছি আপনাদের সকলকেও ধন্যবাদ জানাচ্ছি আমি বলবো আজকে এই মুহূর্তে বাংলাদেশি কমিউনিটির জন্য নিউ ইয়র্কে একটা বিশেষ দিন আমরা আজকে সূচনা করলাম এখানে উপস্থিতি আপনারা কম থেকে নিরাশ হওয়ার কোনো সুযোগ নাই এখানে যারাই এসেছেন প্রত্যেকেই বিরাট ব্যক্তিত্ব ওনারা বহন করেন বিরাট রকমের জনসংখ্যা বাংলাদেশি আমেরিকান আমার বক্তব্যের প্রথমেই আপনাদেরকে বিশেষভাবে অনুরোধ জানাবো আমরা যারা পরিবার বর্গ নিয়ে নিউ ইয়র্কে বসবাস করি তারা সবাই যেন ছেলে হোক মেয়ে হোক যাদের আঠারো বছর হয়ে গেছে তাদেরকে যাতে 
ভোটার তালিকা তালিকাভুক্ত করেন এটা অত্যন্ত জরুরি বিষয় আপনারা প্লিজ আজকে বাসায় গিয়ে দেখবেন কার 18 বছর হয়ে গেছে আপনারা ওদেরকে ভোটার তালিকাভুক্ত করবেন এটা খুবই জরুরি বিষয় আপনার আমাদের নতুন প্রজন্ম একদিন কংগ্রেসম্যান হবে সিনেটর হবে আমেরিকার প্রেসিডেন্ট হতে পারে এটা আপনাদেরকে হেলান আবু শেখের কথা সবখানে সব লোকই বলতে চান সবাই এগিয়ে আসবেন এই প্রত্যাশাই আমরা রাখি হু ইজ দ্য নেক্সট কাউন্সিলম্যান অফ डिस्ट्रিক্ট 32 হেলান স্যার হ্যাঁ হু ইজ গোইং টু মেক হিস্টরি হেলান স্যার হু ইজ ইওর কাউন্সিলম্যান হেলান স্যার Who is my councilman? Who is our councilman? Thank you very much. So for you, I have put together 40 reasons why I think he is the right candidate for this position. He has also been a strong public advocate for all of our communities. He attended New York City College of Technology, also known as City Tech. the city university of new york where he earned his bachelor's degree in computers information in 2000 at city tech he was the first student of south asian descent to be elected president of the student government association later he went on to earn his master's degree in adolescent mathematics education from brooklyn college Halal is happily married with his wife Dr. Tania Mukid. She is also an attending physician at an internal medicine at New York City Hospital in uh, Montefiore, Bronx. For an 8th grader, my dad is Halal Ashik and he's running for New York City Council's District 32 seat. First of all, before I go on any further, I just wanted to thank all of you for attending because I know it must have been hard. to just come here at this time and today. Um, so just thank you for attending. If you didn't already know, my dad is an active figure in our diverse community and is always trying to help people as much as he can. As his daughter, I have an up-close perspective on how he is and I can tell you that he truly cares about this community. To be here tonight, it is a privilege actually to be here. Uh, in 2013, um, I did not know who Halal Abu Sheikh was. I had no idea who he was. I decided that I was going to run for city council and he decided that he was going to run against me. And in 2014, he said, Kim, let's work together. And so we spent most of 2014 knocking on doors, going to meet people, and I got to know who Halal Sheikh was, and everybody has told you who he is, but the three things that are most important to him are his family, his faith, and his community. And, and we know very much what it takes in order to win. He needs your support, he needs your prayers, and he needs you to get out and tell everybody that you know what to do when the primary comes along. And you have to make sure that you get out and tell every single one of your neighbors to vote, because that's what we have to do. We are living in very perilous political times, and we need somebody in city council who understands what it's like to have to struggle, who understands what it's like to have to fight for the things that are important in our communities, and who understands what it's like to be a part of the minority community in New York City. And that person is Halal Sheikh. So I thank you so much for having me here tonight. I understand that I'm standing probably between you and your meal. So I will get out of your way. Thank you so much. God bless you. Many person in our community last few days asked me, Halal Sheikh, he has any possibility to win. I replied only one word, yes. It's possibility to win. But we need your help. Financial help is most important in any election. District 32, more than 100,000 voters. We need Almost 200,000, am I right? 200,000 we have, we need to raise. If we can raise $2,000, is 
200,000. It's possible to win. So I'm requesting you as much you can. You contribute this campaign. I believe you are not helping Halal Sheikh only. This is an investment to our community. Very few attendance from our young society. It reminds me again and again. We have to talk to them. Just before this event, I was sitting table right there. I was talking to former president of district, council district, of district five, community board five. He, he was telling me why young members of your community I saw every day to the mosque. Almost 70% young people go to the mosque. Nobody here today, tonight. So try to bring them. They are our asset. So I request each one of you, please try to convince them to the benefit of ourselves and overall benefit of our community. Aske Jakinia Amadur Mustan Takiami or Victor Put Pokotke Ovinundor among Shubeta Danach. Nibason Kup Kotin Dinish A Nibasuni America Muto Jagai Nibasuni Dini Protidin Tapor Chen Kup Shahos Nahole Abon Tar Jukotanahole Say Nibasuni Kokono Kiwasena Ami Halal Shaker Jibon Bitanto, Boshoshi Polam, Arakum Juko Betti, Judi Unakiama Nibasone, again in Tipari, Abong Nibas to Kurtipari, Tahole, Amra Jarakani, Jukurasti Boshwash Kurti, Unar Nibasone Alaka, thirty two, Akane, Shudunoi, America, Amra Made. যে রকম সমস্যা রয়েছে এই সমস্যাগুলি উনি যখন সংসদে বা তার প্রেসিডেন্ট এবং নির্বাচনী এলাকা যিনি আছেন তাদের কাছে তুলে ধরবেন তখন কিছু না হলো সমস্যার সমাধান হবে I was given the opportunity to work on his campaign and I actually came from Maryland uh, yesterday so I'm a junior at the University of Maryland I'm studying bioengineering but I actually have an exam tomorrow morning but I heard that his fundraising dinner was this weekend, and um, to me, my grades, you know, are maybe number two after my family and my religion, but um, I realized that even more important than showing up to my exam tomorrow morning, you know, with a lot of sleep and, you know, a good breakfast is making sure that a man like my uncle is elected into office. Because for me and for college students like me and for the high schoolers and the middle schoolers and the elementary schoolers, that are my skin color, that are from the same part of the country that I'm from, this is what matters. Because we can get A's and we can get the degrees that we want to get, but in this current political climate, you know, we can't get anywhere unless we have people representing us. And my uncle is going to be the first of many and hopefully an inspiration of a generation to come behind him to inspire us so that we can take public office and so that way we can do the things that matter, you know. A lot of us will aspire to become doctors and lawyers and businessmen and engineers, but not enough of us, you know, aspire to become servicemen, people who want to, you know, carry the torch of justice and people who want to make sure that the policies that are affecting us currently and that will affect our children and our children to come because, let's face it, none of us are going back to Bangladesh to live there. None of us are going back to anywhere in South Asia or anywhere else in the world to live there. We love this country and we're going to be here for a very long time. So now it is very important that we make sure that men like my uncle are in office. We make sure that men that look like us, that women that look like us, people of our skin color, people that understand our religion, that understand how we eat, how we live, how we talk, that they are all in office because that way they can secure that future, so that way when we get our degrees, when you know I take my exam tomorrow, 
it feels like I'm taking my exam and knowing that there will be one day be a secure future you know, for me and hopefully for my children and for generations to come. So please, please support my uncle. Um, you know, please make sure there are people representing us in our home. You know, America is our home. We proudly love this country and we should definitely help and participate in making its policies. My brother Halal Sheikh, he win and he uh, bring our voice to the city hall. Thank you all. <laughs> It is to our dear community to make a better take of power. I'm like the America Tassi, Uja Helal by the major term of peace deal, Kupal Lakishama, or Nutu Projono, where I come to Mother Bobisho, where I can talk with our dear councilman, president, president of Hotebari. In the Kajko to our community show by Minimish Kajko to be Tadaki in it to be. This is the first time, and tonight is the best night for me, for New York, if we can elect a councilman like him. Are you ready to elect him? Yes. If you are ready, just get ready and bring everybody to the meeting. Bring all the committees to come here and join with us and elect a person who can raise his voice in our community. Amra, we cannot go anywhere if this is a big community, in, look at it, London. They elected a mayor, member of the parliament, and somebody would be the minister soon in England, and an ambassador, Anwar Choudhury, from England. We are proud of all these community leaders who contribute mainstream politics. আমরা আশাবাদী এবং আমি বিশ্বাস করি এই সময়টা অত্যন্ত সঠিক সময় হেলাল শেখের জন্য আমাদের জন্য আমাদের কমিউনিটি আজকে নিউ ইয়র্ক শহরে ফাস্ট গ্রোইং কমিউনিটি আমরা যদি এক জোট হয়ে কাজ করতে পারি বিজয় আমাদের আসবেই আসবে এটা কোন এই নিউ ইয়র্কে পৃথিবীর সবচেয়ে গুরুত্বপূর্ণ শহর নিউ ইয়র্ক আর এখানে যদি আমাদের কমিউনিটির একজন প্রতিনিধি আমরা কাউন্সিলমেন্ট করে City Council, Padate Bari, Tabi Hobe Amadir, Askir, Ekanasha, Ebongi Somoy, Bekara, Amadir, Sartobata. Oboshi, say Agadi Council in Hobe. Ibole, Nokinto Yavar, Yetun Matro candidate. Yeto Amadir Kaimona, Amra Sai, Bronze Second Election to Cortesana, Brooklyn Kenonai. Jamaica is not a candidate. But we have all the candidates. And we have to say that 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 we have to say that